behavioral, psychological, and educational interventions. People with ASD may be referred to a healthcare provider who specializes in providing behavioral, psychological, educational, or skill building interventions. These programs are often highly structured and intensive, and they may involve caregivers, siblings, and other family members. These programs may help people with ASD learn social, communication, and language skills. Reduce behaviors that interfere with daily functioning. Increase or build upon strengths. Learn life skills for living independently. Other resources. Many services, programs, and other resources are available to help people with ASD. Here are some tips for finding these additional services. Contact your healthcare provider, local health department, school, or autism advocacy group to learn about special programs or local resources. Find an autism support group. Sharing information and experiences can help people with ASD and their caregivers learn about treatment options and ASD-related programs. Record conversations and meetings with healthcare providers and teachers. This information may help when it's time to decide which programs and services are appropriate. Keep copies of healthcare reports and evaluations. This information may help people with ASD qualify for special programs. Menu. Overview. Signs and symptoms of ASD. Causes and related factors. Diagnosing ASD. Treatments and therapies. Join a study. Learn more. Autism Spectrum Disorder. Overview. Autism Spectrum Disorder, ASD, is a neurological and developmental disorder that affects how people interact with others, communicate, learn, and behave. Although autism can be diagnosed at any age, it is described as a developmental disorder because symptoms generally appear in the first two years of life. According to the Diagnostic and Statistical Manual of Mental Disorders, DSM-5, a guide created by the American Psychiatric Association that healthcare providers use to diagnose mental disorders, people with ASD often have difficulty with communication and interaction with other people, restricted interests and repetitive behaviors, symptoms that affect their ability to function in school, work, and other areas of life. Autism is known as a spectrum disorder because there is wide variation in the type and severity of symptoms people experience. People of all genders, races, ethnicities, and economic backgrounds can be diagnosed with ASD. Although ASD can be a lifelong disorder, treatments and services can improve a person's symptoms and daily functioning. The American Academy of Pediatrics recommends that all children receive screening for autism. Caregivers should talk to their child's health care provider about ASD screening or evaluation. Signs and Symptoms of ASD